Hi, my name is Shahid Tandon, and I live in a world where texts occupy about 80% of the world's communication mainstreams. Some people use full-fledged sentences to communicate, while others use shortcuts like slangs or removing vowels from the sentences just to sound good. But have you ever wondered how a machine would react or understand every slang word you use? Because I've never seen a dictionary made just for texting slangs, have you? That's one of the reasons why we need text analysis. Let's have a look at what it is. Text analysis is also known as natural language processing and it is a branch of artificial intelligence. Text analysis makes use of machine learning and natural language processing to provide a structured data from unstructured text documents that are provided to it. It is the process of deriving important information from unstructured text data. The data could make sense or not. It doesn't matter. It is mainly used for computational linguistics, information retrieval, and statistical analysis. How did text analysis come into existence? With the rise of big data, the traditional strategy of analyzing text manually in order to understand the themes and patterns in our data has become slow and inefficient. It would be impossible to manually analyze each record and still, still keep up with analysis demands. For this reason, text analysis has become increasingly popular as a way to automate this process and discover new patterns and trends that might have gone undetected otherwise. If there is a text, we can tell you what it's supposed to convey. That is what we do via text analytics. And it has a variety of applications that are relevant to both business and scientific researchers. You can see that the growth of unstructured data in 1998 grew immensely due up till 2020. Why is text analysis required? Today, most consumer feedback shared openly online and a lot of socialites like company surveys are in free form text, which are often referred as unstructured data. Let's look, have a look at flowcharts showcasing the process of text analysis. The sentence is broken down into a bag of words. The ta we tag the words with parts of speeches. We filter out the noises from the bag of words and then visualize or analyze the words. This portion is known as data preparation, while visualizing and analyzing the words comes under analytics. Unstructured data is different from other types of data because it cannot be organized into numerical fields or analyzed using traditional business intelligence softwares. Let's have a look at applications. No matter the industry, insufficient risk analysis is often a leading cause of failure. So we provide the ability to link, link together information and be able to assess the right information at the right moment via text analytics. We measure customer opinions, product reviews, feedback, as well as sentiment analysis. Today, text analysis software is frequently adopted to improve customer experience using different sources of valuable information such as surveys, travel tickets, customer call notes to improve the quality and effectiveness in solving their problems. Text analysis is used to provide a rapid automated response to the customer, reducing their reliance on call center operators to solve the problems. Applications such as CIP, Cognitive intelligence platform are able to monitor thousands of resources and analyze large data volumes to extract from them only the relevant content. Spam filtering is also possible because of text analysis. As for the social media, text analytics can address both by analyzing large volumes of unstructured data, extracting opinions, emotions, and sentiments, and their relations with the brands and products, and this is very useful for a particular business. Let's summarize what we have learned so far. Text analysis, also known as natural language processing, is a branch of artificial intelligence. Text analysis helps us make confirmed decisions. Text analysis makes use of machine learning and NLP to provide an unstructured, a structured data from an unstructured text documents provided to it. Lastly, thank you.